Yes, hello, good evening everyone, good evening world Good evening Tacloban, Luzon, Visayas, and Mindanao Mula apare hanggang hulo Isang mapagpalang gabi po sa ating lahat And of mm-hmm. course, we just want to say Hi, good morning and good afternoon To the other side of the world yes. And once again, this is your Coach Presi coach, uh, yeah. And you are now on Kingdom, Kingdom Talk, Talk Philippines. Yeah. But before that, let's put on Mam Beverly Tipton Hammond from Minneapolis for the introduction. Greetings, Kingdom Talk family. God bless you. We're so excited for our speaker for today. I would like the opportunity now to read his bio. The speaker today is Dr. Jerry Grillo. He's an author, motivational speaker, businessman, founder of the Favor Life Church and Fog Zone Ministries. Dr. Grillo helps motivate and train network marketing corporations to reach their fullest potential. He has a dynamic personality and is highly sought after for his resources in spiritual business and professional circles. Dr. Grillo is called the Millionaire's Pastor. Dr. Grillo straight from the heart passion and high energy motivates audiences to step beyond their limitations to live a life above average, and to move into their greatness. His charisma, warmth, and humor have transformed ordinary people into extraordinary achievers. He does this by causing his personal failures and success. He uses those experiences. He also uses the experiences of others and their challenges to build an understanding of what works, what doesn't work, and why. Dr. Grillo has empowered thousands of people around the world with his books, audio teachings, and leadership seminars. He has written over 30 books, including bestsellers, 40 Keys to Financial Flavor, Life, Live It to Win, and his newest book, Live Big, Dream Big, and Be Big. Dr. Grillo has completed two bachelor's degrees and holds a master's degree in pastoral ministry as well as a doctorate of divinity from St. Thomas Christian College. He is also a member of the American Association of Christian Counselors. Dr. Jerry has been seen on TBN, Daystar TV, Word Network, UNPC, Laser Broadcast, Dove Broadcast, INSP, INI, Cornerstone TV, WHKY TV, The Faith Channel, The Now Network, and CTN. He has been featured on many programs, including Real Life, This Is Your Day with Benny Hinn, The Harvest Show, Atlanta Live, Babby's House, Praise the Lord, The Herman and Sharon Show. Dr. Grillo has inspired sales for the Zija Corporation, Conspect Builders, GBG Corporation, Dave Ramsey, Advocare, ISP Corporation, American Builders Association, Paramount, Ford, and much more. Dr. Grillo has traveled internationally to such places as Ghana, Malaysia, Germany, the United Kingdom, and his ministry has impacted over 170 nations around the world. Now prepare your hearts and minds to receive the word from God. God bless. Wow, thank you. Thank you very much, uh, Ma'am Beverly Tepton Yes, Hammond. thank you very much, Ma'am, for the introduction mm-hmm. and kingdom favor and blessings to you. And thank you for accepting our an invitation, invitation to introduce our guest in this program. Yes. Because some, uh, I give the bio code express late na, pero mm-hmm. thank you despite na yes, late na. Yes, for accommodating <laughs> us. She accommodate our invitation to introduce our kids to express. Yes. Kingdom salute to both of you. Yes, Sir, Sir Drew. Drew uh, thank you very yes, much. Yes, thank you very much. And kingdom salute. Yes. Yes, hello. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, world. Uh, good evening, Philippines. And good morning and good afternoon in some other parts of the world. Once again, this is Coach Ariel and welcome to Kingdom Talk. And today, I am so excited to... To have this man of God in this program, Kingdom Talk, because I believe that he's not only uh, preaching the, the 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 King's favor, but his life also he's walking in the favor of God. Hey, I'm excited to be here, man of God. I love Kingdom Talk. No, no, no other place to listen except. Uh, when you get to hear and watch Kingdom Talk every day on Facebook Live and all the other streaming platforms. 
Well, my, I'm Dr. Jerry Grillo. I'm in Hickory, North Carolina. I am uh, 58 years old. I turned 59 in uh, December, December 25th. Mm -hmm. I'll be 59 years old. Uh, I've written 36 books. Wow. I'm educated. Uh, I'm, I'm looking. I'm holding a book here right now called 40 Days to uh, uh, a Life of Favor" or "40 Days to a Favored Life." And mm -hmm. uh, I, you know, just a few books. I teach on a lot of a lot of my books. Here is a book. Uh, Live big, dream big, be big. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> uh, if you want to, if you want a bigger future, you mm -hmm. want a bigger world, create a bigger picture. <laughs> wow! So, and so I've, I've uh, I believe that. Where they can find that? Where they can find Doc, the book that you are uh, show, showed to us? All the books I've written are on Amazon. You can find them on Amazon. You can look mm -hmm. up, look up my name. I think uh, Dr. Jerry uh, A. Grillo. Mm -hmm. You can go to my website, and it's mm -hmm. Live It Number Two Win. So Live It Two Win dot com, and that would oh. be L I V E I T the number two W I N dot com. Live It wow. Two Win Live dot com. Win. And it's, it, yeah, it stands for life. My whole mm -hmm. my whole preaching of the kingdom of God mm -hmm. is that we might. We might have life, mm -hmm. and then we might live that life to win. Yes. So life, wow. live it to win. <laughs> wow. I didn't live. I, I'm not born to lose. I'm born to win. <laughs> yes, amen. amen. <laughs> oh, I'm I'm glad to be here. I love you and your wife. I love what you're doing, and I like question format. So don't be uncomfortable if you want to mm -hmm. ask me some questions, or you know, if we can just have a kind of a, a conversation. Mm -hmm. uh, we're living in some peculiar times, brother. Mm -hmm. uh, the world has seen uh, shifts and changes mm -hmm. and uh, yes. people are um uh, there's fear a, mm -hmm. a spirit of fear has come across mm -hmm. with the covid 19 and mm -hmm. one of the things I, I really want to talk about and and uh, really address to the people that are watching because the kingdom of god is a worldwide uh, connection it's not a mm -hmm. it's not a a nationality mm -hmm, thing yes. to be in the kingdom mm -hmm. it's everywhere god's kingdom is in every country mm -hmm. in every race wow. and when we come into the kingdom we are no longer the citizen of our country mm -hmm. paul mm -hmm. said we are now new citizens wow. of a different <laughs> yes a different that's government. powerful <laughs> <laughs> and that government is the kingdom of God. So mm -hmm. what the beauty of the kingdom of God is the uh, nation of Israel. God, Yahweh, became the God of Israel at the Tower of Babel. You see that God gives uh, languages to everybody. Mm -hmm. and, and, he, and, he, and, he, and according to uh, uh, Deuteronomy 4, Deuteronomy 32, according to 1 Kings 22, a lot of people don't have the concept, but the court of heaven, the, the king, the king, the court of heaven, mm -hmm. uh, God over over the courts gave the nations to spirits mm -hmm. and took mm -hmm. yes. the nation of Israel mm -hmm. as his nation. Mm -hmm. That's why he said, whoever blesses her, blesses Israel, mm -hmm. I will bless. Mm -hmm. Whoever curses, I will curse. Now, the mm -hmm. beauty of that is, is that in the kingdom of God, Jesus Christ comes to the earth. He is God, God, man. He dies on a cross to redeem the world, redeem mm -hmm. mankind, mm -hmm. and then he go. He resurrects from the dead. He's the first. He's the firstborn among many to mm -hmm. to, to to be to resurrect. Will mm -hmm. be a resurrected people. We become engrafted into that nation of Israel through the kingdom of God. Wow! So yes. the same covenants that God gave Abraham and the same wow. covenant He gave His nation of Israel is sitting over the church, the wow. kingdom of God. So are you saying, Doc, that that the blessing of that covenant is not only for the people of Israel, but to those people who will Christ, uh, come back to their original citizenship, which is the kingdom of God? the kingdom of god which is which is every christian every christian mm -hmm, who mm -hmm. confesses christ as lord mm -hmm. has shifted their citizenship to wow. a heavenly place or, mm -hmm. and and so we have to stop being somebody asked me what you know how can we stop these racial divides what how are we going to stop injustice uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, and i said as long as men are alive according to genesis chapter 11 god made a a, a statement he said uh, man's heart is wicked above mm -hmm. all things so mm -hmm. as long as man man's government exists there'll never be an end to racism there'll never be an end to, to competition there'll mm -hmm. never be an end uh to uh divert division and injustice mm -hmm. but there's a king that's coming mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. yes. and, and according to Isaiah, that kingdom will be forever. And that mm -hmm. millennial reign is coming and Christ is coming to get wow. his church. Mm -hmm. And then come into, in, in Revelation, we read Armageddon where we, the church, comes back with our king mm -hmm. and we take the earth back mm -hmm. in one kingdom, one government. Yes. There'll be no injustice. There'll mm -hmm. be no racism. Mm -hmm. There'll be, we'll be all citizens. The Bible mm -hmm. says the lion sleeps with the lamb. So mm -hmm. that's what we're looking forward to. Yes. Uh, and so I'm not afraid of, of what's going on. I'm excited that I'm in the kingdom of God. Yes. So are you saying, Duke, that uh, to have a world that uh, without injustice, without corruption, it, it, it is, it's not impossible, but it is possible to happen here on earth through the kingdom of God? Only through the kingdom of God. You're not, uh, you can't put your faith in the Philippines. You can't put your faith in your government, my mm -hmm. government, America. Mm -hmm. Maybe Africa's watching. Maybe Malaysia's watching. Mm -hmm. I, I can't put my faith on in our country, the White House, and mm -hmm. in this election. You know, mm -hmm. is my faith in Donald Trump or is my mm -hmm. faith in some people's faith or in Joe Biden or in mm -hmm. prime ministers or Queen Elizabeth? No, mm -hmm. None of us in the kingdom need to put our faith in anything but in the the name of jesus mm -hmm. and that's the government in which i'm sitting under and i swear allegiance to i swear allegiance to the kingdom of god first wow. first the crown mm -hmm, mm -hmm. i serve the crown called christ mm -hmm. wow <laughs> so and, that, and go ahead <laughs> and that is a powerful uh statement that you have said Doug. really it, uh, it needs to be heard and i need we need to discuss uh what you have said more so that People who are hearing and viewing in this program, they can be empowered through that message that you are uh, saying in this program, Kingdom Talk. Well, and, and this is this is where we have to we have to shift our thinking. John the Baptist said, "Repent." He said, "Repent," uh, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Jesus mm -hmm. preaches, "Repent," mm -hmm. for the kingdom of heaven is now. Mm -hmm. And that word, "repent." It, it, one of the one of the dangers, uh, man of God, uh, that when we read the Bible, one of the dangers is that we we read it too evangelical, mm -hmm. and when we read it just as an evangelicalist, mm -hmm. we only read it for just salvation mm -hmm, mm -hmm. or just saving souls mm -hmm. or just trying to get to heaven. Mm -hmm. When the Bible is is packed full of the mysteries of God mm. and the mysteries of God is the kingdom of God and this word repent for instance when I say mm. repent religious people think I'm repenting from sin mm -hmm. but that word repent really means to change your thinking mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so Jesus was saying you it's time to think different why because mm -hmm. the kingdom of God is now mm -hmm. so it's not coming it's here it's yes. now yes and and and, and it's and, and and after jesus dies on the cross mm -hmm. and he becomes crowned according to colossians according mm -hmm. to corinthians mm -hmm. according mm -hmm. to ephesians he was crowned mm -hmm. and anointed in heavenly place mm -hmm. where was the body of christ so we have to, we have to we have to go back to this this mentality man of god the body of christ is us we're the body of christ mm -hmm. so the head was being crowned in heaven Mm -hmm. So the head was being crowned in Acts chapter 2. Mm -hmm. you, you, you have this thing taking place. Mm -hmm. You have Jesus being crowned. You see him stripping the devil of all his authority. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you, you see the oil being poured on him. And everybody knows when a king is sat. He'll mm -hmm. stand after he's been pronounced king. Mm -hmm. When the king, when Christ stood in the heavenlies in another mm -hmm. dimension, mm -hmm. the oil that gathered in the lap of Jesus uh -huh. fell into the upper room mm -hmm. onto all those saints that were waiting mm -hmm. to be endued mm -hmm. with power. And the and fires appear. Uh, the, the Bible said fires appeared over their heads. Uh, mm -hmm. Those were the angels sent to the citizenship. Mm -hmm. Those the, the Bible calls angels as ministers of fire, mm -hmm. of fiery mm -hmm. ministers. Mm -hmm. And so what we have to understand is that when Jesus was crowned, the body was anointed. Mm -hmm. So the body of Christ is you and I, mm -hmm. and all the others that are watching. And once we understand that, once the head got a, got crowned. The body got anointed and we got filled with the Holy Ghost, mm -hmm. which is the wisdom of God. Mm -hmm. So now we walk on planet Earth, mm. not as how we used to be. Yes. Now we need to change our thinking. Yes. We need to change our thinking. Mm -hmm. The kingdom is now. Mm -hmm. I want yes. everybody watching, everybody listening to me right now. You're about to shift into an unstoppable faith. Mm. You're about to shift into an unstoppable season. Wow, wow. You're about to move in an unstoppable anointing. 
There's not a demon, there's not a principality or power or ruler in mm -hmm. any nation mm -hmm. that can stop what God has preordained in mm -hmm. the kingdom of God. <laughs> it, it, it's it's such a sobering uh, when we realize that there is no color, there are no the, the nations all bind together under one blood and one mm -hmm. one flag. And the flag that we all uh, sit under is the line of the tribe of Judah. Mm -hmm. So you and I and everybody watching in every nation and everywhere, we're in one. We're in one nation. That nation is the kingdom nation. Mm, <laughs> so, yes. Somebody should hashtag favor nation <laughs> and kingdom nation. <laughs> yes. You know the, what you are saying, Doc, is uh, is really great because uh, now I understand. Because you know when I before my dream is to become a pastor on the end. It may place only, but the Lord really told me that He called my dreams a uh, religious dreams because He says mm. to me that you know the kingdom of God it is a, a, a worldwide event. So why yes, don't yes. don't limit yourself only in your place because my move is a, my movement is a worldwide. So when I when I walk on that revelation and accept that truth that came from Him, then it begins yes. to happen into my life. Well, and you know, the, the, the beauty of this is Jesus said in, in Luke 17, 21, the kingdom of God is neither here nor there. The kingdom mm -hmm. of God is within you. Mm -hmm. And so every, it, it, one of the dangers of being on the earth, one of the dangers of religion is that we're constantly looking for our future. Mm -hmm. So we're constantly trying to get to our future. Mm -hmm. We're constantly trying to get uh, somewhere beyond where we are. Mm -hmm. And the problem is, is we can never get beyond where we are. Mm -hmm. We're created to only live in where we are now. Mm -hmm. And we're always trying to have something tomorrow. So we're, you were believing tomorrow we're going to be better. Uh, mm -hmm. my next year, I'm going to be more successful. Mm -hmm. And, and when you, when you think like this, you keep chasing a dream, you mm -hmm. keep chasing success. Mm -hmm. You keep chasing a good marriage. Mm -hmm. When you have to know in the kingdom of God, you already blessed. You already favored. You mm -hmm. already got a good marriage. Why? Because it's already inside of you. Mm. God hid his treasure in earthen vessels. So yes. You, you yes. don't have to. There, there's no blessing around you that mm -hmm. can get to you. It's already inside of you. Mm -hmm. It's not. It's not getting the blessing to come to me. Mm -hmm. It's me opening my mouth and letting the blessing come out of me. Wow. Favor of God <laughs> is inside of me. Mm -hmm. And once I learn that I'm full of value, <laughs> see, everybody lives for volume. Mm -hmm. I want a bigger house. I want a bigger car. I need more money. I need better clothes. That's volume. Mm -hmm. When you know your value, you'll have all the volume. The value is the is the word God hid inside of every mm -hmm. one of mm -hmm. us. Mm -hmm. the, the Bible said he had not sent his word. He, he said, when I sent my word, it will not return unto me void, mm -hmm. but it will accomplish that thing which I sent it to do mm -hmm. and so we have to understand that we are that word mm -hmm. you and i are that word so when i when you and i come together in agreement when when you're you and, and percy and i we all come together and we get in agreement we start making sentences of the kingdom mm -hmm. three words make a sentence you see what i'm saying <laughs> yes, yes so each one of us has a, a meaning of value everybody listen everybody watching they have value they have meaning they have purpose Mm -hmm. One of the one of the uh, travesties of, of the definition of purpose is that we interpret purpose as assignment. Mm -hmm. And so I, I, I don't realize that purpose is not performance. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. that if, if you make pur purpose assignment or, or performance, then I might watch you succeed and I'm still not succeeding at your level. Mm -hmm. And then I start thinking what's wrong with me because mm -hmm. I don't know my purpose because it seems that you're doing greater things. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. Purpose is not performance. Mm. Performance is what you do. Mm -hmm. Purpose is your value. Wow. And when you know your value, you're not going to be mad while God's making somebody the meat, but God made you the dessert. Mm -hmm. And so he says, don't be trying to be the roast beef when I made you the cake. Mm -hmm. And so you're comfortable in your life and mm -hmm. who you are and where you are knowing that when my time is fulfilled, Mm -hmm. My purpose, my value, yes. will perform, mm -hmm, will mm -hmm. produce my performance. Mm -hmm. Wow, that is powerful. <laughs> <laughs> yes. These are the things that heal my mind. I, I've come, mm -hmm. I came through being dyslexic all through high school. Uh, I, I read at um, eighth grade level here, uh, graduating, uh, barely graduated high school, was molested as a child, went through mm -hmm. divorce and Bible school, mm -hmm. uh, been through some, been, been through some times 
where I had identity issues mm -hmm. and and uh, I didn't know who I was. I didn't know. And when you don't know who you are, number one, you do, you won't know where you belong. Yes. Number two, you don't know who belongs, who can, who's, who's, who belongs to you. Mm -hmm. No, you don't know how to connect people to you till you know who you are. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It, it, you, and, and to know who you are is going to become a, an, an, an internal healing mm -hmm. because you don't try to be somebody else. Mm -hmm. You start being comfortable with who you are. Mm -hmm. Then those that are assigned to help you get to your future and help you get to your success and help you unlock your blessings, mm -hmm. they'll show up because your identity will draw what belongs in your world. Wow. 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 <laughs> Your identity will will draw what belongs to to to, our, to my you, world. Yeah, your faith. You you will never attract the favor of God. You know, the the thing about favor, and I pre I've written about twenty books on favor. Here, this is on book on favor. Mm -hmm. I've written fifty two weeks of favor. Mm -hmm. Favor makes no sense. Weather forecast for your future. Extreme fog. Mm -hmm. Favor of God. Uh, 40 keys to a fa financial favor, mm -hmm. uh, 31 favor decisions. So I've written a lot of books on on the word favor. Mm -hmm. And the, the the people don't have favor the favor of God because they, one is that they don't understand that the love of God and the favor of God are two different things. Mm -hmm. uh, the peace of God. And the favor of God work in two different equations. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And so I can have the presence of God in my house, his peace, mm -hmm. but never qualify for his favor. Mm -hmm. So I'm saved going to heaven, but I have no benefits being unlocked for me on the earth. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you follow what I'm saying? Yes, 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 yes. Favor is simply God's endorsement. Now, Let me let me God's tell some people it's God's endorsement. Mm -hmm. When when whatever God endorses, hell cannot unendorse. Ooh, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> and 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 so what we have to understand is it's not I'm not I I receive Christ through love. Mm -hmm. I serve him mm -hmm. by by allegiance. Mm -hmm. I'm rewarded by favor. Mm -hmm. Wow. Favor is the reward system for obedience. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When you obey an instruction, a season of favor explodes in your mm -hmm. life. Mm -hmm. When you when you when you understand favor, and you don't tri see many people trivialize favor in the mm -hmm. church because they call it luck. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They say, "Oh, I had good luck today." Luck is is trivializing favor. You don't live in luck. You're yes. in the kingdom of God. There is no luck. Yes, that's right. If you found a $20 bill, God favored you. If you got the front parking at a store and every, and it was crowded, you need mm -hmm. to stop and say, thank mm -hmm. God I'm highly yes. favored. <laughs> yes. You have to recognize every moment of favor in mm -hmm. your life because mm -hmm. God's going to endorse you in places to see how you recognize them. Mm -hmm. So favors God's endorsement. Favor mm -hmm. is, is the shortcut. When God favors you, it's shortcuts to uncommon success. Mm -hmm. Favor is a shortcut to uncommon increase. Mm -hmm. Favor is a is the shortcut to access. Mm -hmm. When favor comes in your life, when God begins to favor you, you're going to see access. Doors mm -hmm. are going to open. Not just in money, not just in Uh, speaking engagements or mm -hmm. or um, success doors to other people doors into the world of the wealthy mm -hmm. when God the first thing God did when he favored me it, when the first sign of favor is he starts pulling you into uh, relationships with people you wow. would never have got into without favor mm -hmm. <laughs> and, and they'll be very wealthy they'll be There are people right now assigned just for kingdom talk, so wealthy to pay off every vision, wow. every debt that yes. the kingdom has. Yes, and when yes. God favors you, they just show up and they mm -hmm. want to and they want to pull you into their world. So mm -hmm. favor is access. It's simply someone in the season you need to get in. Mm -hmm. They're willing to leave that season and enter your season. Mm 
mm. <laughs> and help you get into their season. That's wow. <laughs> I've had some of the wealthiest men, Dr. Mike Murdoch's my spiritual father. I've flown on private jets. Mm -hmm. I mean, I've been in the world. Uh, I drove a Mercedes and a businessman paid for it. Mm -hmm. When God endorses you, the world is gravitated to you to bless Woo. you. <laughs> <laughs> hallelujah. Glory. Oh, hallelujah. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Proverbs 835 is what I built my ministry of favor on. Proverbs mm -hmm. 835. Where, where the Holy Spirit, the whole chapter of Proverbs 8 is about the Holy Spirit and how God says, the Holy Spirit says he did not fathom the deep, built the foundations or anything without me, wisdom. And, and this passage right here says that whoever finds, 835, whoever finds me, me is wisdom, finds life mm -hmm. and obtains favor <laughs> from the Lord. Now, The Holy Spirit is the connector to favor. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The, the more we keep growing in relationship with the Holy Ghost, mm -hmm. the more God's going to favor us. Wow, wow. Now, here's why. Here's why. In this passage of, of, of Proverbs 8, this is what the Holy Spirit said, and I, I want you to hear it. He says... I, he says, he didn't do anything, and I'm paraphrasing for sake of time, mm -hmm. but he says, he didn't do anything in the earth without me, mm -hmm. the Holy Spirit. And here's what he said, and I, I read it, verse 30, then I was beside him as a master craftsman, mm -hmm. Holy Ghost. Mm -hmm. so, so listen to how the Holy Spirit so, um, prescribes himself, or uh, this, uh, uh, how you say that, um, how he uh, describes who he is, mm -hmm. right? Listen to what he says. He's a master what? Craftsman. Mm -hmm. So I have to understand that the more I can move in the mind of the Holy Spirit, mm -hmm. the more master creativity I'm getting in my Ooh, spirit. Yes. Right? He's a master craftsman. So I'm a builder. I'm not a destroyer. I'm mm -hmm. a, I, that's why I said life and death is in the power of the tongue. Mm -hmm. So then he says, and now watch what he says. I was daily... God's delight. So the Holy Spirit says, I'm the master craftsman and I'm God's delight. Mm -hmm. So when the, when so when God sees the Holy Spirit, he smiles. Mm -hmm. He's delighted. Mm -hmm. So the Holy Ghost brings him pleasure. Mm -hmm. Okay? Now watch what he said. He says, I was master craftsman and I was his daily and I was his delight, rejoicing always before him, mm -hmm. rejoicing in, in his inhabitant world. Mm -hmm. So the Holy Spirit's rejoicing in his inhabitant world, God is rejoicing every time he sees the Holy Spirit. Ooh. <laughs> so when God sees the Holy Spirit, God is compelled to speak. Mm -hmm. And so we know this because in Genesis chapter one, it says, and the spirit hovered over the face of the deep. When God saw the Holy Spirit over the face of the deep, he began to speak to the earth mm -hmm. and say, let there be light. Mm -hmm. When Jesus was in the water of in Jordan and the Holy Spirit was right there and, 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 and Jesus looked up into the Father, the Bible said God spoke to the earth and said, this is my beloved son. So anytime there's a compressed presence of the Holy Ghost, mm -hmm. <laughs> God's going to open his mouth. Ooh. He's going to speak. Mm -hmm. So watch what he said. The Holy Spirit is his delight. He is a master craftsman. And then the Holy Spirit says this about you and I, brother. He said, and my delight was the sons of men. Mm. <laughs> so, so listen to this. Listen to what's going on. We mm -hmm. have a king. His name is Jesus. He's sitting in a courtroom of heaven. He's, a, he's on a throne. He's advocating for us day and night for any indictment hell tries to bring against us. Mm -hmm. Then we have a father who is delighted with the Holy Spirit, who when he sees the Holy Spirit, he wants to give his word of favor and blessing. Mm -hmm. And then the Holy Spirit said, I find my joy in the atmosphere of men. Wow. <laughs> wow, so the wow. Holy Spirit finds pleasure mm -hmm. with me and God finds pleasure with the Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. And wherever God is pleased, There is favor. 
<laughs> wow, wow. Yes. <laughs> That's why you want to be filled with the Holy Ghost. Mm -hmm, That's mm -hmm. why you don't want to let people take the Holy Spirit and throw them out of the church mm -hmm. and only spend 20 minutes and get out of there. You want to tarry in his presence. Mm -hmm. You want to read his word in his presence. Mm -hmm. You want to sing in the presence of the Holy Ghost. Mm -hmm. Why? Because when he is connected to you, mm -hmm. God is going to favor everything you do. Wow, wow. <laughs> That's powerful. Favor. God's <laughs> In, in, in Daniel chapter 7, Daniel says he saw the horn making war against the saints. Mm -hmm. And he says that the horn was prevailing. Mm -hmm. And and now you see this court again. It, one of the reasons people don't get their prayers answered is they don't know how to approach the courtroom of God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They don't understand that God sits on a throne and that's a court there. And you've got to address with protocol, enter mm -hmm. his gates with thanksgiving. Enter his courts with praise. You, you, there's a there's a procession to get an audience with the judge called God, mm -hmm. and this procession is called the law protocol. Mm -hmm. And a lot of people don't under, get their prayers answered because they break protocol when they're moving into the courtroom of the Holy One. Mm -hmm. The next thing is we understand is that this court was set over Daniel chapter seven, and Daniel said. That the ancient of days saw the horn beating down mm. the saints. Mm -hmm. And here's what the Bible said. And the court was set. And the judge made a judgment. And the Bible said that God made a judgment in that court. And said he judgment was for the saint to give them favor. Mm -hmm. yes. <laughs> and they would possess the kingdom of God forever. Yes. So what, what beat the devil down mm -hmm. was God's favor. Mm -hmm. God destroyed the devil's attack on the saints. When he favored the saints, mm. <laughs> the devil could not prevail no more. Yes, 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 that's right. Oh, hallelujah. I need somebody to shout because <laughs> Jesus said the gates. Now listen, here's the, yes. same, here's the same phrase. The gates of hell shall not prevail Man. against the church. Why? Because you've been highly favored Favorite. by God. Mm-hmm. When God endorses you, uh, it, it, here in America, we have check. You know, you know what check? We write checks. Mm -hmm. and, and I'm sure you do it in the Philippines. Uh, and you have your name on your check, and then you, you can write your a check to yourself and sign it. You have your name on the check three times. <laughs> but the teller won't cash the check mm -hmm. until you've endorsed it. Mm -hmm. yes. So it doesn't matter if your name's on the check three times. Mm -hmm. The funds aren't released until you endorse that check. Mm -hmm. When you turn that check around and endorse it, you favored the funds to be released. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> so when God favors us, mm -hmm. it's as if he's endorsing a check. Mm -hmm. And the earth knows that once God endorses you, the funds have to be released. Wow, wow. The blessing has to be released. Mm -hmm. the, and it could be, and, and the blessing's not just money. Mm -hmm. it, it can be money, but mm -hmm. it can be the doc, a doctor. It can be uh, wisdom. It could be mm -hmm. creativity. Yes. It can yes. be, uh, it, it, could ha it could come and endorse your marriage, endorse mm -hmm. your home, endorse your, uh, endorse your health, mm -hmm. uh, where you have favor in your health. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here, here, you know, the New Testament Christian needs to know that the miracle for us is not deaf ears opening. It's not just blinded eyes. It's not just the lame walking. Mm -hmm. We, we want to see those miracles, and they are for the unbeliever. And even Jesus said these these are done for the unbeliever. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We don't we, we don't require the blind to see, the lame to walk, the deaf to hear, to know who he, who he is. We receive him by faith. Mm -hmm. in who he is. Mm -hmm. And so we have to understand that the miracle to us, the kingdom, wherever mm -hmm. we are, whatever country we're living in, mm -hmm. is the keys mm -hmm. to the kingdom. <laughs> yes, Jesus said, I have keys mm -hmm. to the kingdom. Mm -hmm. So the miracle is in a key. Mm -hmm. So a lock is, is a crisis. A lock is a problem. Mm -hmm. Uh, a lock is uh, something that locked you into a, a bad relationship. You, somebody might be watching or listening right now. They're locked into mm -hmm. a financial problem. They're mm -hmm. locked into a health problem, mm -hmm. or, uh, locked into a fear problem. If somebody's watching, listening, they might be locked into depression. Mm -hmm. And you're asking God, get me out. Get me out of depression. Help me get out of, help me pay my debts. 
uh, heal my body. Mm -hmm. But that, that's what we shouldn't be asking. Mm -hmm. What we need to be asking is, Holy Spirit, what key do I mm. require mm -hmm. wow. to get myself out of this lock? Because mm -hmm. <laughs> Jesus has <laughs> got the keys. Yes. And, and once God gives you a key, man of God, once God gives you a key, You can never be locked in that situation ever again in your life. Ooh, that's right. So if, if God gives us a key of prosperity, then we'll never live in poverty another day in our life. Mm. Why? Because whenever the lock of poverty shows up, he's given me the favor key to unlock it. Wow. Once he gives me a health key, I'll never be sick again. Why? I have the key to mm. health. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's powerful. <laughs> yeah. And, and the keys work in every country mm -hmm. on planet earth everywhere wow. and so we don't have to look at america and say i was in africa preaching years ago and and i went to a church and everybody wants to come to america I want to go to america I want to go to america mm -hmm. and because they they interpret america as the place of dreams and mm -hmm. the place of prosperity mm -hmm. but i go to this church that seats about 10,000 people and i get up and i say I, and I said this, I said, if you think you got to get to America before you can be prosperous, you're not kingdom. Mm. You're, you're religious. <laughs> Because the kingdom of God is in you. Mm -hmm. And everything that's in the kingdom is existing inside of you Ooh. by faith. Come on. <laughs> and, and, and when I said this, man of God, when I said this, 10,000 Africans jumped to their feet and began to <laughs> sing, it is well, it is well with my soul. And, wow. a, and a spirit of, of favor fell over that church and people were laying car keys. I never even took up an offering. People were putting deeds to houses on the, mm. on the, on the platform and wow. car keys and money and, and, and crying and weeping. Mm -hmm. and, and the man of God at the church takes me back in the office. And he says, 15 years ago, a prophet came and prophesied that a, a white man would stand in our pulpit. Mm -hmm. And when he would and when he would prophesy, he will quote Luke 17, 21, and he will release the favor of God. Wow. And 15 years later, I was, the, I was the white man in the African church who took Luke 6, 17, 21, said the kingdom of God is neither here nor there. Mm -hmm. The kingdom of God is in you, and that mm -hmm. kingdom is favor. Wow. <laughs> wow. Why, why do I want? <laughs> so, uh, bro, favor, brother, favor is about to explode in your house. Favor is mm -hmm. about to explode on kingdom talk. Wow. Favor, Amen. The kingdom nation is about to explode. Mm -hmm. 20, 2021 is going to be the year of triple, Woo. quadruple increase. Yes. For you and your wife. P people Hallelujah. are going to start calling you up, writing checks to buy cameras and everything yes. you need <laughs> and property. Uh, my friend, my, 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 people don't get this, but God wants to give us land. Mm -hmm. He wants the kingdom to have land. I, I, we're going to yes. own lands and houses. <laughs> According to Deuteronomy chapter six, he'll give you houses you didn't build, lands and properties and real estate. God's going to, so this is favor. Write this down. If, you, if some of you are listening or not, write this down. Here's some keys. Favor eliminates year favor. Why do you want favor? Number one, it it can eliminate years of pain. Mm. One one day of favor, <laughs> one day of favor. David said, "One day in your courts mm. is better than a thousand yes. elsewhere." Number two, one day of favor is worth a thousand days of labor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. One day of favor. You would work a thousand days to get what God can give you in one day of favor. True, <laughs> go. <Nope. laughs> This is why you want it. Number three, favor <laughs> gives you. Favor will give you in a day what it took others a lifetime to do. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It God gave Joshua in a week. Jericho and no country or kingdom could bring down the walls of Jericho. Mm -hmm. But when God endorses you. Ooh. Yeah. Hell cannot unendorse you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. Favor is currency for money. Mm -hmm. Favor. Somebody asked me, how do I get favor? Honor. Anywhere there's honor, there's favor. Anywhere there's favor, there's money. 
Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Doc. <laughs> Favor is, is God's endorsement for you to move in places you didn't qualify. When mm-hmm. favor comes on you, you'll become a king and you didn't qualify to be a king. That's <laughs> David. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. <laughs> favor is is God connecting you to the right mentor. Mm-hmm. Why do you want to be favored? Because if Ruth hadn't had Naomi, she'd have never got the favor of a Boaz. Mm, yes. So you don't know who God's bringing in your world, who's going to mentor you into the field of favor. (laughs) God needed to get Ruth into the field of favor and to get her into the field of favor. He attaches her to Naomi. Mm. He lets the the husbands are dead and Naomi and, and, and Ruth and Orpah are now in a, in a famine situation. They got no husbands. They're, mm-hmm. Naomi's out of place. She, she mm-hmm. doesn't belong in Moab. She's supposed to, she says, let's go back to Bethlehem, Judah. Mm-hmm. Let's go back to bread and praise. See, prosperity and praise always produces favor. Mm. <laughs> and so, so Ruth follows Naomi and Naomi's not even a happy mentor. Mm-hmm. Naomi is ill. She's irritable. <laughs> she's, she's fussing at him. Go read mm-hmm. Ruth chapter three. Mm-hmm. And here's what she says to Orpah and Ruth. Go back, go home, get away from me. Mm-hmm. The, the, the test for favor is how well you can, you can weather the season of struggle. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Sometimes you're not going to feel like you belong where you belong or the mentor is not going to make you feel accepted. But can you Mm -hmm. stay? Can you hang on to a man of God Mm -hmm. and to a mentor? See, because Naomi was telling Ruth to go back to Moab. That's where you belong. But Mm -hmm. Ruth, Oprah goes back. But Ruth grabbed hold of Naomi and she says, I entreat you. I entreat you. Mm -hmm. Do not send me away. Mm -hmm. Your God is my God and your people will be my people. Mm hmm. That was the connector to a life of a Boaz. Wow. Oh, somebody's listening right now. There's yes, a Boaz yes. about to enter. I just heard the Holy Ghost say that God's about to connect somebody into the right Boaz. Listen to this prophetic word, somebody. This is for somebody. God's about to move you into the right place. Mm-hmm. Don't be afraid to glean for a season in mm-hmm. the right place because mm-hmm. the Boaz is watching you. Mm. <laughs> to favor you to own the field you're gleaning wow, in. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> Hallelujah, favor. <laughs> <laughs> My heart is overflowing of that message, though. <laughs> <laughs> Everywhere there's favor, there's there's increase. Ruth was favored. She's got a she own, she be, she she marries a Boaz. Daniel found favor with the king. Mm-hmm. Joseph found favor with with Potiphar. Mm-hmm. Joseph everywhere. Joseph everywhere someone put Joseph. Joseph got favored and God pulled him out. Mm-hmm. The brothers throw him in the pit. God favored him and an Ishmaelite got him out. Mm-hmm. They put him in Potiphar's house. Potiphar favored him and he's the head he's the head butler. Hmm. They throw him in the prison. The Bible <laughs> said God favored him and he beca- he becomes the guy that holds the keys to the prison. <laughs> he says he, he, the, the, they then they put him in front of Pharaoh. Pharaoh favors him and the Bible said he becomes second to Pharaoh in the courts of Egypt. So are you saying Doc, that the favor of God it doesn't it doesn't matter whatever cir- circumstances we have because it works. Absolutely not. <laughs> A circumstance could be setting you up for favor. Mm-hmm. A situation, a crisis, an attack. Mm-hmm. Somebody's falsely accusing you. Had not Potiphar's wife lied about Joseph, mm-hmm. she would have never strategically put him where he belonged to be with Pharaoh. Mm. When, when God has favor on your life, He's even using the devil <laughs> to get you in the right posture and place wow, for wow. favor. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Somebody shout hallelujah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, that's powerful. Oh, glory to God. <laughs> favor is the proof of God's approval. <laughs> <laughs> glory wow. to God. 
So thank you very much, Doc. Uh, I know that it it is it's empower every one of us who are listening in this yes, program, Kingdom you. Talk. Um, Kingdom salute to you, and we really appreciate that for that powerful message in this program, Kingdom Talk. Thank you know, you, while brother. you are sharing that message, uh, I don't understand myself because there's a tears that comes into my eyes <laughs> and while you are saying mm. that word. And I believe that the Holy wow. Spirit is uh, doing, uh, wow, God, uh, ministering in our in, in the midst of this uh, program yes. that we have. It, it blesses yes. me and I believe that it will bless also to those people who are listening in this program. And I really oh, appreciate hallelujah. that. And I, I need I, the Holy Ghost is saying to me I need to invite you again in this program Kingdom Talk <laughs> <laughs> I'll come anytime you ask I love Kingdom Talk thank you guys for joining and being part of the Favor Nation and hey we just speak favor and blessings and Father I just ask now that you send a garrison of angels yes, to protect my my friends in the Philippines yes. and you touch their ministry God and anything yes. that rises up against them will fall and yes. all those that are watching and listening and hearing us God they're they're about to move into the season of unstoppable mm -hmm. favor yes in Jesus name Amen. thank you very much doc and I think you need to invite them to view also your Facebook live yes yes it's at Bishop Grillo is by is on Facebook live uh, or uh It's uh, I believe it's Jerry Jerry A Grillo Jr. and uh, is is my name on the uh, uh, Facebook page, and I do a I do a morning motivation right about right after you guys. So I think mm -hmm. I come on right after Kingdom Talk, and uh, we just you know we just here to hook up. So I'm here to help Kingdom Talk, and uh, you want to be a part? Come on in. If you can go to my website, and get any books you want. Let me know, uh, and. Uh, We'll be we'll be excited. Go on Amazon and find and, and and write a write a review if you read a book. Let me know how yes. it was. And maybe someday we can bring your book here in the Philippines so that we can. Oh, so that, uh, give me your so address, they, brother. Yes, <laughs> thank brother. You, private message me your address as soon as we get off this talk, and I will send you books, and you won't have to send me a a, a red nickel. Yes, what a powerful message, Coach Presi, that we have heard from Dr. Jerry Guerlo. Yes, that was indeed a powerful and amazing message. Wow. That Are was, you blessed, Coach Presi? That's right. Mm -hmm. Amen. And I, actually, I have some notes here uh, Ooh, because I just powerful. I just don't want to miss this uh, uh, powerful uh, message that I have received right now mm -hmm. that... Uh, Uh, favor is the reward system wow. for obedience. Mm -hmm. That's right, Coach Ariel. I believe on that. That is why we need to become a uh, law abiding citizen, mm -hmm. especially in the kingdom of God. That's Coach right. Christy. In order for us to enjoy the favor from mm -hmm. our mm -hmm. God. That's right. And the uh, favor is not a lock. Wow. Hindi yung kagaya, hindi yung... Hindi yan, katulad ng sa atin, yes, sports press, na, is swerte. Yan, swerte tawa. sa... <laughs> sa uh, yung sinasabi lagi na, sinuerte ka ngayon. Yes. In no, the kingdom, walang swerte. Yes. <laughs> Lahat ay favor. In yes. the kingdom of God, hindi luck yung nag-operate, but the, the favor, favor of, of our king. Yes, <laughs> that's right. And according to uh, Sir Grillo, Favor is God's in endorsement mm -hmm. that once God endorses you, even hell cannot unendorse That's you. That's right. Wow, that was a very mm -hmm. powerful. Mukang mm -hmm. dami mong sinulat niya. Yes, actually, I have uh, a lot of notes here because sabi ko nga ayo kung uh, mamis yung bawat uh, napapakinggan ko na katotohanan the mm -hmm. truth that I am receiving mm -hmm. from Dr. Jerry mm -hmm. and uh, another is favor will not will let doors to be opened mm -hmm. and uh, favor will give you access wow, wow. glory and, and he says good expression favor is a shortcut to uncommon success, success and, and increase. increase yes that's true <laughs> Yes. Amen. It is an uh, unbelievable. Yung parang mm -hmm. masasyak ka. Yung parang sabi, wow. Parang hindi ka makapaniwala sa gagawin yes. sa'yo. It is the favor of God. That's right. And favor will cause everything to be gravitated toward mm -hmm. you. Parang hihigupin ng lahat. Mm -hmm. Wow. Towards you because of the favor of our King. Yes. 
And uh, uh, that is the reason why because of the favor of God coach Percy uh, itong si Joseph he become next to king mm-hmm. because of the favor of God. Yes. And one thing that uh, I really love is uh, uh, Dr. Jerry uh, shared with us that when God favored you God can even use the devil wow. to get you to the right position. Wow, wow. yes. That was indeed That's, powerful. You know, favor really is powerful. That's why we need to prepare ourselves, yes, especially indeed. our character, because mm-hmm. uh, the fav- the, the, there is no problem of the favor of God. Yes. Anytime God wants to give us a favor that mm-hmm, comes because from Because it him. is His will. And that, that, that is a, all we need to do is to prepare ourselves, mm-hmm. equip Position ourselves, ourselves. E- equip our character mm-hmm. by allowing God to mold us, to equip us and empower us so that when that favor came, hindi comes. tayo ma... Hindi tayo malulula, hindi mm-hmm. tayo malulunod sa favor na ginawa ng Diyos sa atin. Yes, hindi natin mamimiss. We will not miss mm-hmm. the favor of our King when the seasons of His favor comes into yes. our lives. And no, and you will become unstoppable. Yes, person. that's right. Mm-hmm. And uh, everywhere, actually, favor is everywhere. Yes, uh, Wow, thank you very much for that powerful message, yes. uh, Dr. Jerry. Mm-hmm. And we really appreciate your life. Thank you for accepting our invitation yes. to have you in this program, Kingdom Talk. That's right. And extend our best regards to your wife mm-hmm. and more kingdom favor to both of you and to the yes. ministry that you are working mm-hmm. along. Yes, Coach Pressy. So thank you for joining us in this evening program, Kingdom Talk. Mm-hmm. Shout out po sa inyong lahat. Yes. Sa lahat po ng nanonood ngayon sa lahat po ng nakikinig sa lahat po ng naabuti ng programang ito yes. uh, kingdom favor po sa inyong lahat mm-hmm. Keep, uh, don't forget to share like and invite your friends to watch this watch, uh, yes. program that we have today mm-hmm. for sure they will be empowered by this message called yes, that right. it is very important for mm-hmm. us to hear these kinds of message mm-hmm. because you know if you think that uh, lahat ng nangyayari ngayon sa atin para bagang Negative. Negative na. Mm-hmm. In God, nothing is impossible. When the favor of God yes. came into your life, then suddenly, mm-hmm. <laughs> magbabago ang lahat ng bagay. Wow, that's special. right. I believe on that, Coach Ariel. Wow, thank you very much. Uh, do you want to say, uh, do you want to add anything, Coach Tracy? No, I just want to say thank you and uh, uh, continue to share this message over our Facebook timeline mm-hmm. so yes. that all our friends, loved ones, workmates all our uh, uh, what's this um, friends and relatives yes, families can be reached mm-hmm. by this powerful message mm-hmm. of uh, what we have here on Kingdom Talk now yes, so this message can really uh, bring impact to others other people's lives especially yes. right now in our situation mm-hmm, always mm-hmm. Uh, believe that the king's favor is always there. It's everywhere. In, in the world that we have today, Coach Presley, when you, when you become positive, mm-hmm. aayawan ka <laughs> ng yes, mga tao. That's right. But in, when you are become negative in this sickness, they will be happy. But in the kingdom, <laughs> it is always positive. <laughs> that's right. That's right. Uh, that's why this kind of message, this is a positive message that mm-hmm. you need to share yes. to your friends so that their life can be empowered yes, through the favor right. of God who mm-hmm. express it. Wow, so thank you very much for joining us in this evening. Once again, this is Coach Aya. And this is your Coach Pressy. And we'll be saying, God bless more, Kingdom Favor, and have a great night to everyone. Kingdom, Kingdom salute, salute to, to everyone. everyone. Bye for now. We love you. See you on Friday here on Kingdom, Kingdom Talk, Talk Philippines.